Hello, welcome back to the 100 Baby Challenge. We are starting in cast as I impulsively deleted my entire mods folder and <laughs> downloaded all new custom content. So I've really paired it back just to show you like what's in my mods folder now. I used to be able to scroll forever and ever and ever. This is the extent. <laughs> of my custom content. So I did give Kaylee a makeover. This is her everyday, formal, athletic, sleep, party, swimwear, hot weather, and cold weather. Honestly, we'll see her hot weather, cold weather, sleep, and every day way more often than we will see any other outfits. But I just went for something a little bit more casual, something a little bit more comfortable, especially because as a 100 baby sim, Kaylee will be pregnant very often. Noah, uh, got some new hair and brows as well. This is my sweet little Noe. And finally, we have Jonathan, the only one of our 100 kids who will count. So he is technically 100 baby number one, even though he is our second son and one of three children. However, Kaylee is about to give birth, so let's jump back into the game. All right, let's get into it. And I'm trying a new strategy for the 100 baby challenge, and then I'm really going to slow it down because our infants have to age up as happy infants in order for them to count for the challenge. And Kaylee has been really struggling with that. But if you missed the last part, all of the videos are in a playlist. You can go back and watch it. But I did expand the house quite a bit. And my goal is to make this the mid-century modern house for Kaylee and her 100 children. And then here is the 100 baby house for generation two so we are still quite a bit away from generation two but just know that is what we're working on uh jonathan is very upset because he had a potty accident and doesn't realize that he's actually aged up into a child now but i want him to get started on his homework and noah is already in bed and asleep and by the way i did convert the nursery that was up here into a bedroom for jonathan and you can see i left room for another bed to be added over to this side and then of course we have an additional bedroom here which can fit quite a number of kids and I don't have a problem going down into the basement if I need it to but one of the major changes that I made to help us out is that of course I moved the nursery and toddler rooms downstairs so that Kaylee doesn't have to uh, do as much work on her part. But Kaylee can we do some parenting and just help little Jonathan with his homework because we do want him to age up. Um, I'm so happy that you adopted a baby Hector but no sorry but she's like how fun that you have a baby I'm busy raising my, my 100 children because the sims creator said that I had to give birth endlessly why couldn't I be one of the not so berry sims I don't know Kaylee sorry my love okay she and Jonathan have a great relationship to be fair she and uh, Noah also have a really good relationship it's just that she had a hard time raising Noah. He was our first child. And he's like, wow, mom's helping me with my homework. Look at all the attention I'm getting. Oh, and she's parenting. You know, she's made a lot of mistakes, but she has in fact learned. Apologize. I don't know why she feels guilty. Criticize grades being low. No, don't do that express some love but we can't do some parenting scoring simoleons get a job you're not going to do that my love you're a 100 baby son okay she's exhausted and for reference she is in her third trimester kaylee is getting ready to put her best parent hat on because well pregnancy is almost over and kaylee is more than ready now to give birth to her child and she's also exhausted so i'm gonna let her finish interacting with jonathan and then i'm gonna send them both bed i'll have jonathan eat dinner first don't know what happened because i was getting water but they just had a negative interaction tell him to eat something and then we'll go to bed should i be more lenient oh she feels sad because she's strict well you have to be strict you're gonna raise 100 children they need to know what the rules are and they need to know them immediately and oh my gosh kaylee is about to piss her pants come pee like a champion and then go to bed and jonathan you're upset because of the strict family dynamic he usually respects the authority of his older family members and follows the rule but the high expectations that come with such a good reputation can be very stressful at times. Well, Jonathan, I understand how being the only successful 100 baby would be stressful. However, 
your mom is also very stressed so go to bed oh and i wanted to do this in the game but i totally forgot i want to give the kids who are townie kids the set townies not just the random townies the names of their parents so let's do that jonathan land grab mills we of course had our son zach but zach goes off to live with his parents yes my loading file is glitching i'll fix it later but zach is now living with the fangs and that is his father and listen the fangs are hella rich and live in a penthouse zach will have a much happier life than he would have ever had in this household because unfortunately he did not count hey good job jonathan let's get you to take a shower brush those teeth and go to bed and as a reminder to myself and to all of you in order for jonathan to age up into a teenager he needs to have an a in school and high confidence so you're gonna work real hard my love but he was in fact our only happy infant and he was also a happy toddler neutral confidence sims with neutral confidence are still figuring out how they feel about their own capabilities they can easily be encouraged or discouraged when gaining or losing confidence a sim with neutral confidence will have neither high nor low self-esteem when aging into a team a child's sims confidence level can be increased or decreased depending on skill gain school performance positive and negative socialization succeeding or failing skill-based activities and confident or embarrassed moods and more caregivers criticizing or praising a child's behavior also impacts their confidence level so we'll have to make sure that Kaylee is doing a lot of praising of little Jonathan and that he's working on skills he feels good about. Oh, you're a smelly boy. Okay, come here. No, no, no. Don't go downstairs. Take a nice shower here. And then you are one of my older kids. I can age him up whenever, technically. I just want to give him some chance of a childhood because he's not a 100 baby sim anymore. So we don't have to worry about his quote unquote aging up requirements. Uh, you can have some oatmeal for breakfast. That sounds good to me, Noah. He wants to stay on the same lot for eight hours but my dude you go to school so good luck and i've got to figure out when the romance festival is i just noticed my walls weren't going down there we go okay my love use that bathroom go eat your breakfast have you done your homework oh oh my gosh that's so cute we've got to keep that noah's got his first little school drawing from his first day of school my sweet boy and then we'll have a tooth fairy certificate and a tooth fairy hero sticker which we will put on noah's bedroom wall noah will be one of the only children to get his own bedroom and that's because i feel very bad about how poorly he was raised we do need to also focus on getting some additional money for kaylee she's totally fine her back pain is horrific she is embarrassed because she passed out on this sidewalk <laughs> and peter pants and she wants to make something you know what you can make darling breakfast let's serve up some pancakes that will be a nice treat for both of our sons and kaylee while you still have the chance you can actually clean up a little bit this may be the cleanest your home will ever be and i completely forgot to point out that i also made this little outdoor area for the kids to hang out and play so i'm gonna have jonathan come and dream big there we go now he's gonna go play basketball and i'll have noah join jonathan in a moment he just has to work on his homework where is he doing his homework in jonathan's bedroom yay jonathan good for you oh that was a bad shot and he's very embarrassed about it why don't you shoot around you should be getting your fun up you can do it jonathan and in fact i'm gonna document this momentous occasion because this is the only time we've seen our kids play oh i just noticed there's stuff that we can harvest across the way great job jonathan he likes fitness yes you sure do look at you playing some morning sunrise basketball noah is still doing his homework kaylee is queued up and ready to go oh how cute that she's actually with Noah as he does homework. So let's help him with his homework. I wonder if this will be another boy because we've given birth to boys many many <laughs> many times you missed that's okay jonathan you can develop some skills let's get you ready for your school day so please use the bathroom please grab some pancakes that your mom made noah is getting help from kaylee with his homework Bab. now kaylee please go tell noah to eat encourage doing homework look at her clapping for him okay kaylee i think you're as happy as you can be so we'll let the boys go off to school and then i will send her across the way to harvest some plants and hopefully hopefully have that be our money because I purposely built her this quote unquote greenhouse. It doesn't have very many windows, but does have a glass roof as does all of our house because i forgot to change it and that's fine they can enjoy the beautiful lighting great job kaylee you can do a little bit of painting i think this is the happiest she'll be um until the babies are born realism that does good i don't know but 
go and paint. Go forth and paint my love and my children. You two can hang out. Noah, why didn't you go get breakfast? He's gonna complain about uh, his parents. He's gonna complain about his problems. He's gonna make fun of adults. <laughs> Don't call him a toad licker. You could tell him a goof. Nope. Actually, you can all go to school now. Bye. Have fun at school, darlings. This is perhaps the most peaceful episode of 100 Baby that we've had because our kids are old enough to take care of themselves. They get ready for the chaos again. While they're gone, Kaylee will focus on making money. But Jonathan, oh, he already knows that he actually needs to study hard. Thank you. I can't get you out of my mind lately. Want to go on a date and get some breakfast at a Japanese restaurant? Mortimer, we discussed this. I wanted your genetic material and that was it. And you're married and your wife is pregnant. Beautiful job finishing that. Kaylee, go and use the bathroom before you pee yourself again. We'll get you across the street to steal these plants. Something over here was sparkling and I will be taking it. Where was it? Huzzah! We must steal them all. Harvest the roses and the snapdragons and the pear trees and the bluebells and the apple tree and the strawberries. Kaylee, look at you being blessed. Hopefully she isn't going to labor before we're ready. <laughs> oh, that's it. The baby's getting born. She's too uncomfortable to harvest. God damn it. What did she get? What did she get? Nothing because she went into labor. Uh, looks like I jinxed myself. Um, Can I just send her to have a baby at the hospital without me? Go have baby at the hospital. Send her alone. Bye, Kaylee. Alex is yelling at you. Who cares? Go and have the baby so you can be happy enough to come and collect all of these things that will make you money. Okay. Place your butts now. <laughs> what do you think baby goth will be? And she's very, very pregnant. So please don't be twins. Please, 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 please. I have no idea. I haven't checked. I haven't. She just got pregnant and I'm like, cool, give birth. Well, please don't be twins, but she's very round. <laughs> okay, Kaylee is having a baby. Who is little baby goth? It's a girl. Oh, our first girl, London. London Goth Mills. Thank God it was just one girl. Hey, where's little London? Oh, why a uh, girl, you're pale. Why is she almost blue? Uh, well, let's just come and feed her. My sweet little goth baby. Oh, her brows are blonde too. Does she have mom's blonde hair? But thankfully, our sons are still at school for a couple of more hours and we're making sure that London has what she needs and Kaylee, please don't start with the making a mess. Please don't. Now, where was our Sim who was real mad yelling at us because we were stealing all his shit because I'm gonna steal it again. Where was homeboy? Harvest everything quick before your sons get home. Yes, Kaylee. Let's go. Love that. I don't know who that is and I don't care. Go home. And our neighborhood is in compliance. How nice for us. Okay, Kaylee, what are your needs and can you do anything about them? You're kind of hungry, so let's go and serve up some lunch. Let's do some hamburger sliders for our boys. And I'm gonna clean out her inventory because my girl is a mess. Oh, I broke her sink. Sorry, Kaylee. Thankfully, little London is totally fine and does not need our attention quite yet. Okay, Kaylee, repair. You can grab yourself some food and then for newborns i think they just have to get to their birthday when it's their birthday one is little london's birthday tomorrow why does she look like that oh and it's harvest fest coming up <gasps> that means we won't get the chance to celebrate or get uh jonathan to get an a in school oh you're very tense don't worry you and your brother can come and play when you get back home and i'm gonna lay out some things for kaylee to plant because we want this to start growing as soon as possible i'll plant some of the trees in the back just for some nice little little elements for us. Imagine coming home and your mom just has babies. He is merely satisfactory. Come inside, boys. Are you hungry? Noah, I know that you are hungry, so please grab a serving. And Jonathan, you're mostly just bored. Can you come and play with Blarfy and then also come and just shoot around because you like basketball. This is so peaceful. I'm really enjoying this and I'm loving that I don't have to worry about getting Kaylee pregnant again because she won't be able to until London is officially a toddler and I know counts towards our babies. We'll ask Noah about school. Where is Noah in his school? He's a C student. I know there was an issue before where they weren't like going up in school, but Noah does have a school project and pretty chilly day, but it's not a horrific day. So I might send him out back to do his work while his brother works on um, his basketball stuff. And I'm going to put London's baby print upstairs in our little kid space. Okay. Kaylee is also still pretty happy, which is great. So let me just pause so I can 
can lay down her plants for her. More roses. All of the money. Ooh, snapdragons are hella expensive. Perfect. Kaylee, go and plant. And I'm going to let Kaylee sleep because tomorrow, little London, our first daughter, will age up. And look at the back. <laughs> little Jonathan playing basketball and then Noah working on his school project. Does Jonathan have a school project? I don't think so. No. Cool. Jonathan has reached level three. I love that. Okay. Kaylee, baby is upset. Got it. You can feed her. We'll kiss her forehead. The good thing is that she's so high in her parenting skill too that she can pretty easily resolve the baby's needs, which is great. It is snowing though, my love. So I'm going to want you to stop playing basketball and come inside please so you can do your homework oh she needs a diaper change change her dirty diaper maybe one day kaylee will be able to afford decor okay kaylee change your diaper and then i'm gonna let kaylee sleep because she is exhausted and she really should take advantage of the fact that her kids are old enough to take care of themselves mostly oh uh, you've lost a lot of cc because you just wanted to put everything on okay that's enough go do your homework and you can stop working on your school project because you're really bored so can you use the bathroom and maybe i'll send you out on a little practice your bike ride because you actually don't know how to ride a bike. Hey, great job, Kaylee. Use that toilet. Clean this sink. What, is somebody in there? Jonathan. Okay, you can go to bed. And Jonathan is upstairs working on his homework and he will need to go downstairs and get dinner. We're doing okay. We are taking care of things. Look at our son trying to learn how to ride a bike. It is getting his fun up a lot though. There's a last exception. I don't know from what, but no, yeah, okay. Oh, that's right. He's sick. Kaylee, I need you to order your son some medication. Just keep two of those on on you and then please come here and they give medicine i love kaylee's little bunny hat if you're wondering where that's from it's from gorilla x3 take your medicine now he's like oh i don't like medicine you're gonna take the medicine anyway kaylee you've got to clean you've got to pee like a champion you can go back to bed jonathan is still working on his homework which is fine you my love need to take your medicine take the medicine you have a headache in your set. Yes, good boy. <laughs> he took the bike for himself, which I will go ahead and let him do. Go to bed, my love. Oh, look at that. And little Jonathan also has a little coloring from his first day. From Jonathan Landgrab Mills. There you go. Now, who's the next sim I should have a baby with? Part of me is like Bella, but honestly, I don't know. <laughs> Genetically, what that means for this child, like how would that child that'd be related to London, they'd be siblings, but are they sibling squared? Okay, Good job, Jonathan. You did your homework and I'm so proud of you for that. Please come and use the bathroom. Take a shower. Go and eat your dinner and then go to bed. And as always, this is the I think one of the first times I'll get to say, I will see you in the morning because everyone is good. Little London is awake. Let's feed her. Oh, she already knew. See, I didn't even have to cue her up. She already knew that she had to feed London. And technically it's just after midnight. So it is London's birthday. So I'll age her up pretty soon. I I just want to get Kaylee's needs pretty high and work as much as I can on getting her money up. Well, she's done very well for herself to be raising all of these kids um, and making money completely on her own. Like she started with an empty lot. Great job, Kaylee. Oh, the baby's still upset. What's wrong with her? Oh, nothing. You just wanted to kiss her. She'll be in a mom. She needs a new diaper. So let's change her diaper. Maybe I'll have her do another painting. We're just going to work through the night. And I'll make a grand meal. We'll do a grand breakfast in preparation for Harvest Fest, which is the day after today. So tomorrow, <laughs> since Kaylee is also pretty hungry. Wow, I'm honestly so impressed. Yes, good job, Kaylee. Where'd you put that food though? Where'd you put that food though? It's not in your pocket, girl. So where'd you put that food though? Um, You can actually grab a serving because you're hungry. Okay, and I want to know if Jonathan has the ability to do extra credit. He does not. Noah, Noah never did his homework. His needs are pretty good in terms of sleep. So I am actually going to get him up. Up so he can work on his homework. And I got them both little monster defender lights so they could stop annoying me with their nightmares. Kaylee, my queen, you're absolutely slaying and I love that for you. Go and water all of your plants. Go and plant these trees. Why are these outside? Like you can't plant trees inside. All right, just random trees that I'll move when they bloom. Oh, we've got some collection of roses. Go and sell all. Bab, go to bed. Noah has completed his homework. I am so proud of you, my love. Please go and have the breakfast of your choice. And little London is awake once again. And Kaylee is already on it. What's wrong with London? I'm assuming she's hungry. He's feeling under the weather. Better to have him stay home at this point. Fine. Fine. Call adoption agency. Wait a minute. Oh. <laughs> I was like, can he put himself up for adoption? That's crazy. No, he cannot. And you two can insult existence. 
<laughs> we love the brother's dynamic. Accused of touching possessions. Sure. Uh, trick into believing giant chickens. Oh, wait. Never mind. Go to school. Go to school. It's the reason that he can't go is because um he's sick and if so is that a new feature or is that a mod he doesn't have the option to go to school you my love are gonna study hard because you're gonna get that a he will only get a b today and that is fine because we'll at least see london age up maybe i'll age up noah into a teen as well just to give us the extra space i love that she's just here rocking her my like, girl go to bed go to bed oh she's almost an adult yikes Noah, my love you clean up thank you and your hygiene is low and you're feeling sick so you can come and take a bubble bath and maybe when kaylee is up she can teach you how to ride a bike which failure awaits today everything's going well and that really scares her <laughs> she's like um what ball is about to drop another standardized test jonathan is almost done when he realizes he skipped a bubble near the top all of his answers are one off he starts to tell the teacher but realizes he'll have to take it again um confess a mistake my love and yes i know harvest fest is tomorrow some other kid threatened jonathan i think Kaylee would say he needs to stand up for himself. London is upset. She needs a new diaper. She's a happy girl now. You can use the bathroom. Noah, you're sick. So I think that you should actually nap lazily just to give yourself some chance to recover. I will eventually have to get a toilet in here for Kaylee since this is where she takes care of the newborns. Use that bathroom girl. Marcus, yeah, go for it. Uh, okay, Kaylee, do another painting. Let's do a large classic painting and we'll We'll have a yard sale and then we'll age up london because we've just got the notification that it's london's birthday thank goodness <laughs> we can throw all of our effort into having her be a happy infant great job kaylee come here and sock the table i'm gonna lock this for everyone but household members because you know we know what happened last time with katrina hello i am a 100 baby sim with many many children and lots of bills kaylee convince hiroshi to buy something Give him a sales pitch. London's upset. Quick, buy something. I've had to take care of my daughter. I thought that Hiroshi was wearing a skirt and I was like, slay, what a cute outfit. Nope. Hiroshi's just not wearing pants. Anyway, I've got to go take care of my daughter. Can I just choose the feeding preference? First bottle. Prefers breastfeeding, feed. Okay, is London a happy girl? Yes, London's a happy girl. She is good. Let us go and tend the table. Because we haven't sold a single painting. Yay, Jonathan's a B student. Do you have a school project? No. You know what you could come do? Then play in the imagination time. Play with Noah. Noah, stop playing dolls. You're going to play with your brother. Are you here to buy something? Please, yes. Someone buy something. Please. Who the hell is in my house? I locked the door. I how did you get through the back door of course y'all did look at you just stealing my food and hanging out in my son's room like i didn't invite you meanwhile she sold a painting i didn't even realize christopher mortimer come support your children okay she's gonna take care of london noah i gave you medicine why are you still sick this is just like glitch she's gonna be perpetually feeling unwell but he and his brother are having a great time playing jonathan you can stop you can do your homework and you can go downstairs and have some food because your mom has been cooking and making sure that you all have meals why are you in my house leave Haley, take a shower and go to sleep thank you i think noah's just glitched it just has never gone away like this has been flashing all day hey, jonathan loves his little desk good great yes are you confident now neutral yay jonathan doing homework get leftovers and i'm actually gonna wake kaylee up briefly even though she's exhausted because i do want to praise jonathan for his i cannot even do that okay never mind you can go back to bed hey, my love clean up little noe you are completely exhausted so please make sure you go to bed why is he taking a nap in his playpen like okay baby's crying but you're gonna pee your pants go to the bathroom first bathroom first damn it she's like no my baby is upset go to the bathroom and then you can change her perfect you're hungry that's totally fine come and get some leftovers and today is harvest this fast so that's fun Haley <laughs> likes gardening good for her you've got to come and feed the baby yes it's harvest fast that's very nice we have minimal money my son is awake because he must use the bathroom go forth and potty and while you're at it take a bath i'm gonna let kaylee get her sleep bar all the way up before we age up little london noah is also awake if he's gonna be perpetually uncomfortable i'm just gonna say homeboy is sick and he's just always sick uh, appease the gnome give gnome toy appease the gnome give gnome pie yay appeasing gnomes hey you can use the bathroom oh the gnome did not like that get leftovers oh leave baby we must parent discipline firm tell him not to do that there's like i heard you had a baby with mortimer 
I sure did. Why would you do that? Let's influence him. Clean up mess. Go clean up your mess. He's like, mom, really? Yeah. Yeah, really. I'm gonna need you to cook a grand meal. Let's do a nice turkey dinner. Yeah, clean up your mess. Good job. And let's encourage, encourage cleaning up mess. I know London is upset. Please go get Jonathan's confidence up and then change London's diaper. Inspired from mess. Can you paint? No. Well, why don't you try to appease a gnome? Give the gnome fruitcake. London aged up on her own. Sorry, London. Oh God. She's intense and she is blonde like her mommy. Okay. Well, Kaylee, my love, you want to play basketball? I don't think so. Go make that dinner. Yeah. She looks a lot like Kaylee. She just has Mortimer's coloring. Look at that happy face. London smile for the first time. London, let mommy make this meal because your needs are quite good. Eating dirt is really unhealthy, my love. Your social is low. Come and talk to your brother. We've pissed off all the gnomes, which is unfortunate. Oh, look at them singing their Harvest Fest songs. Okay, Kaylee, this might be your chance to appease the gnome. Give gnome coffee. Hey, everyone's good. Need for forgiveness. And she's maxed her parenting skill. Good job, Kaylee. Kaylee. Talk about toys. Oh my god. Um, 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 picture. A gnome struck my son with lightning. Jeez. Kaylee, so do not destroy your brother's school project. Come and comfort your brother, okay? He's very upset. Kaylee doesn't have any reaction at all to her son being struck by lightning. Okay, Kaylee, you can do this. Is there anything we can do for parenting? Okay, and how is little London doing? She's good. She needs some socialization. Play with a different toy. Yes, our grand turkey dinner is ready. I'm going to put that in the fridge so it doesn't spoil. And let's come and take care of little London. And we'll feed. We'll play peekaboo. She will be the happiest of all of our children. Noah's off to play with one of the infant toys. Okay. London! Look at you, baby number two. What is wrong with her? She just needs attention, which we're giving her plenty of, and she is tired. We'll give her a nice feed before we put her down for bed soon. We did a little cleanup of her. Can we do some tummy time together? She peed on Kaylee when she ate which is great. You put her down. I want to do tummy time. She's not tired yet. The mat is too far away for you. Don't worry. Don't worry. Let's tell her a bedtime story to make sure her social need is good. Yeah, she's just tired. Yes, life is very upsetting. Enjoy this bedtime story. We'll soothe her to sleep. We'll kiss her to good night. It's almost Kaylee's birthday, which means I do want her to get pregnant as soon as possible. But again, we cannot age the infants up until they have the happy infant or top-notch infant and trait three mashed baby foods one finger food crawling and pincer graphs milestone requirements that we need to get them to age up early so that is in fact where i am going to end this part i hope that you did enjoy it i think it's our more peaceful episode of 100 baby challenge let me know who you think our next baby parent should be and i will see you in my next video